Hello, um, my name is Jordan Boone. You guys probably know me from the first video, or maybe you don't. Um, but I'm a third year chemical engineer here at Ohio State University. And this time, I will be showing you how to tie a tie into a bow, into a bow tie. Um, so basically, what I've done is I learned something from somebody else. Basically taught me how to double my entire tie wardrobe. Uh, it's basically by turning a regular tie, um, like a full-length regular tie, into a bow tie. Um, so just make sure you understand what I'm saying. This is actually not a bow tie. But a full length tie. Um, so I will show you how to do that. First step, obviously, is once again getting the right tie. So in my sense, uh, this tie here is um, a little bit fatter, kind of like a like a little fatter narrow tie. It's probably about two inches, maybe a little bit, maybe two and a half. You want to make sure your tie is pretty thin. Um, so for example, this tie is probably about the same size. However, it's a little more thicker in material. Um, so it usually makes it a little bit harder to make the bow tie uh, to really make it stand out and make it like a real bow tie. So. I probably wouldn't use that one. Um, skinny ties are not like real skinny straight ties like this. They're not really very good because the ends don't really flare out like a real bow tie do. So it kind of makes it harder to do it again. And then this is kind of another example of another tie that I would tie earlier into a different tie, um, the boo knot. However, it's kind of thick once again. Um, doesn't really make a really good knot. So, so starting off with this is pretty. It's really simple. I promise. It's probably all of. It's really just three steps. Start off with your regular tie. I'll take the fat end. Take the fat in. You actually want to fold it up. Uh, if you have this, it'd be really helpful. If you don't, it might be a little bit harder. Um, but I'll show you how to do that over anyway. So basically, you just fold it up into that, um, and literally you just fold it. I would say um, until you feel like it's a pretty good length. Um, I would say like that's like a pretty good length. So basically, you can put it up here and you basically see how to, how fat you or how long you want your bow tie to be. The more you take it in, the more the longer it'll be. Obviously, so literally just put it into the thing like that. If you don't have this part on your tie anymore, if you broke it off or didn't come with one, uh, simply just fold it over. Um, and just be real careful when you're doing it. Make sure you keep it that same size. So going back to what I was doing, I'm going to tuck it in here. You tuck it in the first time. Uh, you can flare it out. It doesn't really matter. It's not a big deal. You won't be able to see that. So you want to take this part in. You want to fold it. Uh, make sure you keep it wherever you're tipping. You can fold it up a little bit, but just make sure you keep this in pretty good and fold it once. Um, and then I like to fold it again usually just to kind of get that the nice pretty pretty thick bow tie um, so it really depends on how, how thick you want it to be um, I would say I would fold because it's a skinny tie so the fatter your tie is the less you probably actually can do it so it just kind of really depends so you fold them like this so once you have your tie go ahead and put it up against your neck set it right here uh, and take the other end the skinny end now Flip it so that the seam is facing outward. And with your right hand, you want to go over the top and then tuck it back down. There's no magical hole or anything like that. You literally just tuck it back down and it should work just fine. Um, so now you'll see that it's kind of just sitting there on my on my neck. And then I tighten it up. Take the bottom end of the skinny that you folded over and just pull it. Pull it out and then pull this down. All right. So when you pull this down, it'll kind of tighten up against your neck. And in order to make that flare of a bow tie, you want to tighten this more. All right, so you can pull a little bit more on the bottom end, just kind of make it a little bit tighter on your neck, depending on how tight you want it to be. Well, the tighter you have it, the longer it'll stay up there, uh, and the better and the better it'll look. So once you have it tied up there, basically you'll see that and this is kind of sloppy now. Hit the short end again, tie it back over, and tuck it back in. So it'll come out on the bottom here, and just make sure you keep it nice and in the middle somewhere so you can see it's like. It looks like it's supposed to be there. Just kind of cover up that end. Um, and so basically now you have a bow tie. Um, so basically what you do then is take this part. And just kind of tuck it into your shirt. Uh, I, I usually like tuck it into like a, the second button or so. Uh, that way I can still get to it and adjust it. Uh, during the course of the day, it's obviously it's going to get a little bit looser as you kind of go wrong. You move your neck around. If you need to adjust it, all you have to do literally is just pull this part up from the bottom. Pull it up towards your face. And then go ahead and tighten it on the, on the bottom with the thing inside your shirt. And there you are. Uh, like I said, typically these bow ties work better if you have like a, like a thinner tie. Um, probably about narrow, like two, two and a half. But that's simply how to tie your tie into a bow tie. Alright, thanks.